All right, check it out. Elgato sent me this sweet package, Project Wave. I'm all Elgatoed out. You've got the, uh, the software right there. You got the, the key light right there. <laughs> You've got the stream deck there. You've got the Wave 3 right there. So what is this? Well, I think I actually already know what it is, but I'm trying to be suspenseful. Unfortunately, lifting with one hand is a challenge. Ooh. All right. So we got the shock mount for the Wave 3. It all fell out from there. All right. Oh, sick. Dude, I have like every Elgato pin, like all of them. I have the Stream Deck pin. I have the HD60 pin. I have them all. Um, this is the pop filter. I'm gonna put this all together. It looks like there's uh, some extra arms. I'm gonna put this all together uh, after I open this, but yeah. All right. Laughter, conversation, song, music, sound is everywhere. An endless wave of expression and you're part of it. Your words matter. Now share your voice with the world and be heard. Your friends at Elgato. Wow. All right, so I've been using this for a few months now, okay? Apparently I have a beta version of the, the mic, all right? Uh, so, <laughs> yeah. Look at this. This is the actual real retail kit. And I'm gonna talk a lot about my experience with it. Okay. Uh, because I've been using it for probably about two months. Make sure there's, see if there's anything else underneath here hiding. I don't expect it, but nope. Doesn't seem to be the case. This box is sick, uh, honestly. Um, so, uh, something fell. So yeah, look at this. Look at this. Double wave threes. And uh, they look pretty much the same, but uh, yeah, awesome. So I'm gonna go ahead and put all this stuff together and add the shock mount, or uh, not the shock mount, the uh, pop filter, which I have not been using. I've been, uh, <laughs> I've been using this. I called it the witness protection program because it hides the logo and I was so afraid that I was gonna take a picture of all the stuff on my desk and it would be in there and people would be like, what's that? And I'd get in trouble. I know Miguel from Elgato who is amazing, just awesome to work with, great dude, great creator. I showed him this picture and he like, what did you do to it? So uh, yeah, anyway, uh, let me go ahead and put this together and we'll talk a little bit more about the Elgato Wave 3. All right, so I have it all set up. As you can see, uh, the beta unit that I've been using for the last few months is right here. And the new one, the official release of the Wave 3 is right here with the shock mount and pop filter attached. And uh, you can see it is a thing of beauty, uh, so sleek. And uh, I know that it's not really meant for this stand and this is a temporary solution until I can get something better. Um, but I wanted to use the shock mount and the pop filter. The pop filter slides right under here. I can already see one change that they made between the, the beta unit and this one. Uh, you can see the actual knob uh, right there that you unscrew uh, to put in the uh, the pop filter and uh, to hold the mic in place with the stand. Uh, they are much nicer, kind of more rubberized uh, on the, the actual release. And it actually has, oh, they both have the Elgato logo on it. Um, so um, otherwise, uh, pretty much the exact same mic um, I don't know what's going on inside. I mentioned earlier my lanyard. This is the lanyard that I wear to uh, all my events. You know, you can see all my PAX East, uh, different <laughs> things for like literally every year since they've done it. Um, so I've got the, the, the Stream Deck one, the HD60S, and the Elgato logo. 
uh, to go along with uh, now the Wave 3. Um, I also have Operentia and Xbox. So anyway, um, but yeah, man, this is a beautiful unit. Uh, so sleek. It, it's just honestly, it sounds fantastic. And we're going to hear that in just a moment. So uh, that is it for the product itself. Um, you know, very, very easy to set up. It also has the Wavelink software uh, where you can have up to six different sources uh, on this mixer. And right now it has the mic for all, all or for five of them. That's just the way it was. I didn't set it up that way. I haven't messed around with this as much as I probably should, but you can see the meter picking me up and everything um, from the mic. So the mic is actually active, but theoretically you could set your, um, you know, your game capture software as one of the sources, uh, actual music as one of the sources, um, maybe a sound effect track or something as one of the sources and have actually up to six sources um, of, of sound recorded with whatever you're recording uh, because you'll see uh, we actually use the Wavelink software as the source within um, you know OBS or whatever it may be and it picks up all those and records them all as separate tracks. So that is gonna be huge for people uh, that want a little bit more control. Uh, so now let's hear how the mic actually sounds. All right, and here we are with the Elgato Wave 3. You can hear me and I'm probably super clear. Obviously I can't hear myself at the moment, but uh, this mic is absolutely fantastic. It's very powerful, very strong and it makes me sound really great i mean i feel like i've heard myself for years now making videos on youtube i've been doing this for almost 10 years and before that i did radio uh in college so i mean i've heard my voice through mics a lot and i worked for bose for many years this is you know sound and audio is something i know pretty well and uh this is the best i think i've ever personally sounded um, I'm not even that close to the microphone right now. And I mean, there's a fan running somewhere. So like, this is fantastic. I've been using it for about two months now. Um, as you can see, we've got the, the Fortnite music playing in the background. It's this new heavy metal mix uh, for chapter two, season three. We've got Kit here, one of the new skins. I'm up. It has a built-in emote. Absolutely love this thing, um, but we can actually go through. I've got all the skins here on the Fortnite. Creator code, J Shock Blast, by the way. Love Deadpool. Um, so yeah, man, uh, this is this is honestly the best mic I've ever had. I mean, I don't say that just because I'm a partner, just because they sent this to me, just because of any of those things. I love this thing, man. It's, it's sleek, it's, it's just a powerful mic. It takes up way less space than my other mic did. I think I had the Blue Yeti or something before. Um, I've had some bad mics before. Um, I've had the Audio Technica. I've had um, the Snowball. Um, the <laughs> I had the Meteor mic. That thing was the worst. Um, actually, my most popular video, one of the like top five videos I've ever made, over five million views, is a Spider-Man video uh, from Amazing Spider-Man and I was using the Meteor mic, and it's so bad, you can hear the disc spinning in the Xbox 360. This has none of that. I mean, obviously, it's been like, you know, eight years, so you would hope things get better, but, um, you know, this is a USB mic, and I know there are a lot of people that like, you know, using, you know, more pro gear, and this gives you that feel. Plus, with the Wavelink software, uh, where you're able to have, I actually was reading up to make sure I was right. You can actually have up to eight sources. Um, so it's pretty crazy. Uh, all the different possibilities you can have. You don't have to buy this big old mixer. It's just one more thing off your desk and off your setup. Um, you know, it's, it's really cool. So there's two versions of the mic. There's the Wave 1 and the Wave 3. Um, from what I can tell, because I haven't used the Wave 1, uh, the Wave 1 doesn't seem to have the opportunity um, to switch between controlling the headphones and the um, 
and the actual mic itself on the unit, there's a dial. Uh, you press that dial in and out to mute it, whereas on the actual Wave 3, uh, there's a mute button on top, which uh, you kind of touch. Um, the Wave 1 is $129.99, and the Wave 3 is $159.99. You can actually pre-order it now, shipping June 25th uh, through Amazon. I will have an affiliate link in the description below, as well as a link to the Wave 1 and Wave 3 on Elgato's website. Um, the pop filter is $29.99, which is actually a pretty good price for a pop filter. Um, the Wave Shock mount is out of stock, so I'm not sure how much that is. And the Wave extension rod is also out of stock on their site, so not 100% sure what those are. But, I mean, honestly, this is a great value compared to some of the other mics on the market. You're going to pay twice that for some of the, you know, Shure Pro mics and stuff like that. So, I mean, I, I don't really have a lot of experience using those. When I did college radio back, like, 20 years ago at this point, practically, um, geez, now I just feel old, um... When I did college radio, we used a lot of that stuff, but I wasn't, that wasn't my bag. You know, I didn't really know a ton about that. And um, for me, it's always been USB mics and I've really found a lot of value in them and I've found them to be really good. So this is definitely my favorite that I've had. I just, I love it. I can't rave about it enough. And um, I really think that once you get your hands on it, you will too. So uh, definitely check it out. Uh, hopefully, you know, if this video doesn't sell you on it, you know, you can go back and you can listen to all of my videos that I've made for the last two months. And a lot of them are going to say powered by Elgato right in the bottom right corner. And I just actually hit the mic. So that might be a test of the, uh, the shock mount, anti-vibration suspension mount. <laughs> um, you know, so, I mean, hopefully that is going to give you everything that you need to know, the peace of mind. I know I'm not really playing a game right now, but I've got literally two months worth of videos that you can fall back and watch and listen you know, to how I sound. I probably sound great. For this mic, uh, even though I've been using the beta unit, this is the unit that they sent me today. So I literally plugged it in and, and started using it. So this is how it sounds out of the box, fresh, brand new, no software adjustments, nothing. Um, I think that's good, right? Um, I obviously did a test video to make sure everything was good uh, before this, but you know, um, I I can't say enough positive things. Hopefully, you've heard enough um, from this to make it you know sound like this is something you'd be interested in. Because, uh, like I said, just I I'm gonna keep speaking in circles because I just love this mic, and I'm I'm glad that I can finally tell people how much I love this mic. So uh, that's it. Uh, thank you, Elgato. Um, all the people at Elgato for years have been just absolutely amazing to me, especially Miguel, especially Phil, especially Steggy. I mean, every time I see those guys at PAX East, uh, they're just so cool to me. And I really appreciate them taking a chance on me because I'm not as big a creator as some of the other people that you're probably going to watch videos about this from. Um, and, you know it'd be really easy to not take a chance on people like me, but they do. And I can tell you, I've had problems with their products and they're always resolved. I mean, it's, I, I am so loyal to this company that like, I'm, I'm always, I feel guilty not having Elgato stuff, you know, like it's, it's that, it's that kind of loyalty and it takes a lot to earn that from me. Um, so this is, this is coming from a place where I've spent so much money on their products over the years. And uh, to be able to work with them on stuff like this, it's it's crazy. And I, I'm thankful for it. And um, I hope that you, I'm saying that because I hope you understand that this is my genuine feeling about the product. And I'm not like influenced or anything like that. Um, but I do want you guys to know that I'm, I'm just, I'm an Elgato dude for life, man. So anyway, um, these are available. I, I am so grateful and, and thankful to be able to say you can get these now. Uh, they'll be shipping next week. And uh, I hope this is something you're interested in. Uh, so definitely pre-order because they've been selling out of all their stuff. Uh, all right. We'll see you.